guys, Rizzo here. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I will be doing another episode of the real versus fake video. And this time, I'm going to compare the color my brows. It's from Etude House. I have two right here. I have the... Um, wait, let me figure this out, you guys. I have the real one right here and I have the fake one right here. If you guys are aware, sobrang dami dito sa Pilipinas yung mga tinatawag nila na... Yung mga ganun. <laughs> Natatakot na ako sabihin siya sa channel ko kasi my channel got in trouble because of doing videos featuring those products. If you guys have been on this channel for a while, alam nyo na wala akong takot noon. Like, ginagamit ko yung mga makeup na yun. I did um, swatches of the like fake lipsticks and yeah, my channel got in trouble. So, I decided to delete all the videos na meron akong sinabi na SG authentic siya because it's not. It's not authentic. It's fake. So yeah, if meron sa inyo na nagwo-wonder kung nasa na yung mga videos na yun, I needed to delete it because I don't want my channel to get in trouble again. Anyway, I will be doing a comparison on the real and the fake color my brows from Etude House. Looking at it, you really cannot tell the difference, but when you see the formula later on, you will see. So, so I'm going to compare the price first. This one is 378 if I remember it right. Let me just check. 378 pesos siya and then yung fake, mabibili mo siya for as low as 50 pesos. Meron siya marami sa Divisoria. Meron mga online sellers na nagbebenta nito. Again, it's okay if they admit na hindi siya totoo. Pero meron kasing iba na like sinasabi na totoo daw. Tapos they sell it for the same price as the real one. But then it's fake. Okay, so this is the real Color My Brows. Yung Etude House na logo niya is on the upper part, the fake one, yung Etude House na logo is nasa lower part. Ito, hindi ko sure kung yung fake ganito or baka nag-iba lang ng placement like over time like you know siguro yung first release nasa itaas yung you know so hindi ko alam kung iyan talaga ay batayan ng pagiging fake at saka totoo nitong product na to I have shade number 1 on both nakita ko meron pa lang isang kaibahan pa yung totoo ganyan yung base niya yung fake hindi so flat lang yung fake ito yung totoo. So, meron siyang ganyan, you guys. Tapos, meron siyang number 4 right here, if you can see that. And then, meron din silang very slight lang nakaibahan ng color sa kanya. Ito, medyo deeper yung brown niya. Ito, medyo may pagka-brownish gray yung packaging niya. But, hindi mo talaga siya mapapansin kapag wala kang totoo talaga na may compare Pag open ko sa kanya, mafeel ko talaga na mas secure, mas sturdy yung totoong color my brows compared sa hindi. Like, ito, pag open ko, wala na. Diretso na. This one, pag open ko, parang meron siyang resistance na konti dito sa part na to sa itaas. Like, when you open it like that, yeah, basta meron siyang resistance, you guys. Tapos, yung kaibahan din nilang dalawa, yung sa dito na opa twist na, this one is, this one is like parang mas, mas thinner. Like, you know, ito mas mataba ng konti. Okay, dito na tayo sa wand. Yung nasa itaas, yung totoong color my brows. Yung nasa ibaba, yung fake na color my brows. As you guys can see, yung totoong color my brows, meron siyang ganyang shape. Parang mataba yung nasa gitna. Tapos pa slim siya. Pa, pa slim siya sa tip. Yung nasa ibaba, as you guys can see, straight lang yung wand niya. Again, same shade ako, 01. Pero, obviously, mas darker yung original kaysa sa fake. Like, yung fake, medyo lighter yung ano niya. You can see that right here. And you can see it from the actual wand as well. So, sa wand pa lang, malalaman mo na kung ano yung totoo at kung ano yung hindi. Basta kapag medyo tapered, mataba yung gitna, tapos tapered pa tip, yan yung totoo. Yung ito lang, yung parang plain lang, napa-straight, fake siya. And, ang na-notice ko din sa formula, yung guys. As you guys can see, mas thick yung formula nung totoong color my brows compared sa fake na color my brows. As you guys can see here, medyo watery siya. Ito, like thick yung consistency niya. So, sa formula, yan yung kaibahan. Isa swatch ko yung totoo right there. Para lang makita natin yung kaibahan ng kulay. Kasi this is supposed to be the same shade eh. And then, ito yung fake. Okay. Obviously, this one is way lighter. This one is thicker. Tapos, mas deep yung brown na color niya. Ito, 
ano, brownish gray siya. Um, basa siya ng konti. Ito on the dry formula. Itatry ko siya sa brows ko and see kung meron akong mafe-feel na like ibahan talaga sa dalawa when you apply them. Obviously, I already filled in my brows pero hindi ko siya sinet at all like eyebrow powder lang talaga. So, I will go ahead and apply the original one on this side and then the fake one on this side. So, ganyan yung itsura ng original na color my brows. As you guys can see, mas naging fuller looking yung brows ko tingnan. And it was easy to apply because of the tapered na shape ng um, wand niya. Okay, so this time, I will try the fake one on this side. Ito try ko na i-close up talaga siya. Hindi ganun kadali i-apply yung fake kasi nga watery yung consistency niya. I feel like parang... Madali kang magkamali kasi it's very watery. Hindi siya kumakapit agad. So, ganito yung itsura nung sa fake. Hindi siya ganun kadali apply because again, hindi siya tapered. Yung bristles din niya magkalayo. Like, hindi kagaya nung isa na tapered. At saka yung bristles are closer to each other, you know what I mean? Tapos, the formula doesn't help as well. Hindi siya parang kumakapit sa lashes mo. Yung dryer na formula, kumakapit siya agad sa lashes mo. And kapag in-apply mo siya, like, nandun na siya agad. This one tends to be messy because again, it's more like watery. Hindi siya like watery watery but definitely more watery than the original one. Yung original you guys, mas okay yung shape ng wand. Mas okay apply. Mas okay tengnan And mas madali siya. Yung fake hindi natin alam kung ano yung nandito. Maganda to product na to. Hindi siya ganun kamahal. And for the price, 378. Hindi siya madaling maubos. So para sa akin, sulit na sulit siya. I'm doing this video para maging aware tayo kung ano yung fake at saka kung ano yung totoo. I'm not in any way recommending fake makeup, you guys. I personally do not use fake na mga makeup products. Kung tools siya, okay lang. Kasi it's just tools. It doesn't really sit on your face. You just use it to apply. So, okay lang sa akin. Pero kapag ganito, na mga makeup na like, you know, stays on your face for long, hindi ako gumagamit ng mga ganon. I admit, noon, noong nagsisimula pa lang ako, like, nag-start ako sa mga fake na makeup kasi gusto kong pag-practice-an yung mga makeup and I can't really afford to buy like, legit, mamahaling makeup para lang pag-practice-an, diba? Pero noon yun, and I did not let it sit on my face for more than an hour practice lang siya just to like, you know, what looks good on me, what shades look good on me, you know? So yeah, hindi ako nagre-recommend na gamitin niyo yung fake kasi again, hindi natin alam kung ano yung nandun. I hope this video helped. Please do like this video if you wanna see more. I am waiting for my Colourpop um, lipstick para makompare ko yung totoo at saka yung fake na Colourpop. So yeah, I can't wait to do that video for you guys. I'm so excited kasi ang dami na laganap na yung mga fake na Colourpop online at saka sa kung saan Anyway, that's it for this video. Please do like if you enjoyed watching or if it was helpful. Please subscribe if you haven't already. I hope to see you guys on my next one. Do not forget me. Goodbye!